So hello and welcome. So what's everything that's up, active, messing with you or pushing you off center? And everything that is, do you choose to release, let go, and or allow all that to be removed from your reality now? Ah, yes, I choose that. Whoosh. Out, 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 out. Woo. Banish, vanquish, banish, vanquish, banish, vanquish. Blah. Yeah, now we've all had times when things that we were expecting to happen didn't happen or something just really messed up in our lives. Blah. Yikes. So everywhere that that's happened to you, and then you kind of instantly go into, what's the point? I should just give up. Blah. Woo! Do you choose to release? Wow! Let go and or allow all that to be removed from your reality now. Ah, yes, I choose that. Whoosh, vaporize, liquefy, vaporize, liquefy. Yeah, and it's one of those things is because it's normal to be frustrated, disappointment. Yeah, yikes. Wow. So all the frustration and disappointment that you have when things don't go your way. Blah. Let all that go. Let all that go. Let all that go. Let all that go. Yeah, and so the most important thing around all this is just to notice that, yes, it's actually okay to feel that way. Yeah, I know we don't like to feel that way, and we're kind of told that you're not supposed to feel that way. Well, especially when you're on your empowerment path, you're not supposed to let anything discourage you. You're supposed to just have this positive attitude. Whoa. Woo, and everything that brought up, wowza, you choose to release, let go, and or allow all that to be removed from your reality now. Ah, yes, I choose that. Vaporize, liquefy, vaporize, liquefy. Because <clears throat> the thing is, is we all get discouraged. We all get disappointed. You know, especially when we think something's going to go really well and it doesn't. Woo, yikes. So the part around all this stuff is just to acknowledge and notice those feelings. And then the real trick isn't to just not have those feelings. It's to not let those feelings overwhelm you and go into that that. Uh, cascading <laughs> cascading pit that keeps li leaving you down, 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 down. Whoa. Because what often happens is we have that feeling. We have that disappointment. And then you start justifying that feeling or disappointment be by everything else that went wrong in your life. Have you noticed that? Ugh, yikes. That you have this one thing that goes wrong, and then you go, oh, everything goes wrong in my life. That This thing that happened last week went wrong, and the thing that happened before that, and then last year. Ugh. So everywhere that when you have one disappointment, that builds upon all the other disappointments. So it makes it like really tough to move forward. Do you choose to release, <laughs> let go, and or allow all that to be removed from your reality now? Ah, yes, I choose that. Vaporize, liquefy, vaporize, liquefy. And so the whole part around that is when we get discouraged, um, something doesn't go the way we would like, is it's okay to stay in that disappointment, that feeling for a little bit. And when you're there, don't justify like things never go right. Or then don't start making um, uh, beliefs about what you're going to do in the future. Because this didn't work out. You're not going to do that next thing. The day, oh, wow. So everywhere when something doesn't go your way, um, the belief that comes up is the whole day is ruined. Ooh, yikes. Do you choose to release? Woo, let go and or allow all that to be removed from your reality now. Ah, yes, I choose that. <sighs> vaporize, liquefy, vaporize, liquefy, banish, vanquish, banish, vanquish, banish, vanquish. You know, because once again, it's like I'm saying it's okay to be disappointed, discouraged, but don't stay there very long. And so how do we, ch how do we change and shift that? Well, that's when we use our energetic work. So if you can remember doing the energetic work when something doesn't go your way and it's like all of a sudden it's like all of that. Ooh, so... Let's just, just think about the last thing that didn't go your way. Blah. Ooh, yikes. And everything just that you decided that disappointment, that discouragement means, ugh, that that disappointment or discouragement actually doesn't mean, and everything you decided that that disappointment or discouragement doesn't mean, that that disappointment or discouragement actually does mean. Oh, do you see how even without doing the clearing stuff and just look, looking at that, it shifts it? But everything all that brought up, do you choose to release, let go, and or allow all that to be removed from your reality now? Ah, yes, I choose that. Vaporize, liquefy, Woo! Vaporize, liquefy, banish, vanquish, banish, vanquish, banish, vanquish. Ah, awesome. And everything that you've decided um, that that discouragement meant about you, <laughs> that disappointment meant about your life, <laughs> that disappointment meant about the the chances that you were going to have more of the life that you would like. Woo! 
did his release let go and or allow all that to be removed from your reality now? Ah, yes, I choose that. Vaporize, liquefy, vaporize, liquefy. So what if, no matter what didn't go right, um, you can have a good and productive day? Yeah, so all the judgments about what you would have to do to have a good day. Ugh, what would have to change for you to have a good day? Ugh, yikes, do you choose to release, let go, and or allow all that to be removed from your reality now? Ah, yes, I choose that. Whoosh, vaporize, liquefy, vaporize, liquefy, vaporize, liquefy. Ooh, so let's just do some energetic work to change and shift stuff so that you can have a good and productive day. <sighs> yep, so all the judgments you have about what a productive day would mean and all the things that you would have to do to say that you had a productive day. Whoa. Let all that go, let all that go, let all that go. Yeah, so this is one of the things that's kind of a tricky thing around all this stuff, is we all have a to-do list that there's no possible way we could get everything done that's on your to-do list today. Yeah, vaporize, like, oh, fine. So what can happen is even if you have a really good day and you do a lot of work, you create more than you thought you possible, you tend to compare it to that never-ending to-do list. Yeah, yikes. So everything that brought up, do you choose to release and let all that go? Yes, I choose that, vaporize, like, oh, fine. So what if you could accomplish at least one thing that would be a contribution for you and a contribution for your life to accomplish today? Do you see how that feels possible and there's that opening? Yes. And so anything preventing you from accomplishing at least that one thing that would make today good, that would make you feel better, that would actually help improve your life, whoo, do you choose to release, let go, and or allow everything that's preventing that you accomplishing that today to be removed from your reality now. Ah, yes, I choose that. Whoosh, vaporize, liquefy, vaporize, liquefy, vaporize. <clears throat> now, what awareness, energy, and frequency can you and your body be to accomplish at least one of those contributive tasks, contributive projects today? Ooh, awesome. That feels great. So I'm Max Riggs, Energetic Awareness Coach, and helping you access more of the energetic change and energetic creation field so you can step into the more of the person that you would like to be. Have a great day and I'll chat with you soon. Bye for now.